I think one of our hardest things to get was 99% alcohol. As much as we shipped over there, a lot of times, because we used so much of it to do all the dirt work and to everything else we were doing, <coughs> we shipped a lot, but you know, it would disappear. And then we were ho island hopping, so mm. we would have stuff shipped you know, way ahead of time to these islands. Well, it would never come, so we would order more. And sometimes it would get through customs, so we'd get it. And then we'd go to the next island, and it wouldn't be there. We'd order it ahead of time, wouldn't be there, so we'd order more. So we kept ordering all these gallons, I mean, 10, 20, 30, 40 gallons of alcohol. When we got to um, the Grand Bahama Island, which was actually the easiest place to get stuff because we were going to be there for a while, we had taken, I think, 50 gallons of alcohol with us. Well, about a week and a half to two, uh, maybe about two weeks after we got there, all the alcohol that we had ordered from all these islands that we had been to <laughs> all showed up in the Bahamas. <laughs> So we had like 200 gallons of alcohol <laughs> at one point. And it wasn't that funny because we wound up using all but I think about six gallons of alcohol when all of a sudden, I mean, we used so much alcohol. I mean, these poor guys were gassed out every morning, but it was the only way we could keep everything on them was to yeah. use the alcohol-based tattoo inks for all the dirt and everything. <laughs>